As spring turns to summer, our new May-June 2012 issue of Woodworker's Journal, on sale at newsstands May 1st, should get you going on some enjoyable and practical summertime projects. To kick things off, Editor-in-Chief Rob Johnstone builds a handy patio garden cart for getting your planting started early, or even for use as an all-in-one elevated planting bed. Our cover story by field editor Chris Marshall will introduce you to Rockler's clever new system for building plantation shutters. Using self-centering drill bits, two durable jigs, and a free design program on Rockler's website, you can make fixed or movable louver shutters in any size, quickly, easily, and at a significant cost savings over buying them pre-made. Chris also shares a wall-mounted nail gun cabinet in the new issue. It's compact and provides a way to store both your pneumatic nailers and a full collection of fasteners. You can build it easily in an afternoon. Or for a fine furniture project, master woodworker Ian Kirby crafts a handsome oak bedside cabinet with overlay panels. You can make one following the measured drawings and instructions in this article, but it's also one of the teaching projects Ian presents in our three volume DVD series, The Way to Woodwork. We've got plenty of exciting tool news in the May-June issue as well. If you're in the market for an affordable way to sharpen your chisels and hand planes, Shandor Natsalansi shares the pros and cons of nine different honing systems in our today's shop department. Our tool preview this time gives you an exclusive sneak peek at Festool's brand new Domino XL slot mortiser. We're told that it's not available until June, but Rob Johnstone had one in his shop recently. He'll share some preliminary thoughts about this bigger brother to the classic black and green domino. For our reader survey this time, the results are in, and our survey group of fellow readers share their strategies, concerns, and preferred tools for managing sawdust in the shop. And as always, we share the latest on what's coming off the production line from woodworking tool and product manufacturers in this issue's What's in Store department. Or maybe it's time to broaden your woodworking skill set. An expert wood turner, Ernie Conover, will help you do just that. He shares two projects, a carver's mallet and a wooden assembly hammer, so you can fine tune your spindle turning techniques. Bill Hilton will fill you in on his methods and reasoning for making loose tenon joinery with the router. It's his latest installment in our ongoing skill builder series on router joinery basics. And remember to check out the related More on the Web videos and additional content for both wood turning and skill builder at woodworkersjournal.com. To round things out, there's fresh content in our other regular departments, shop talk, tricks, letters to the editor, finishing thoughts, and so much more. So check your mailbox for the new May-June issue coming soon. You can also find it on local newsstands May 1st, or order a copy at woodworkersjournal.com.